Hello everybody, it is Prodigy Queen again, and in this Prodigy video, I'm going to share a new update that's coming to Prodigy in, a in August 2020. It Prodigy is going to make all the characters and like it's going to make all the colors of Prodigy really, really, really vibrant. And also, Prodigy has released the new Summer Question Quest. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the like button and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of these awesome Prodigy videos. Alright, so let's get this video started. So here is the Summer Question Quest. The Summer, the Prodigy Summer Question Quest has begun. Help us reach our goal by the end of the summer and get a very special prize in the game. So there's a video about Prodigy Summer Question Quest. So let's see what it's about. Let's play the event. So calling all wizards. And there's a picture of a boy and a blonde wizard. Or join us this summer for the drum roll, please. <laughs> Prodigy Summer Question Quest. All right, so let's see what it's about. We need your help to reach our goal of 500 million questions answered this summer. Whew, that's a lot. But a lot of people play Prodigy, so I guess that's not a lot to them. If we reach our goal, you get a special loot drop. Guys, loot drops are so good. I'm going to pause the video right here. Loot drops are so good because Prodigy releases like some really cool items. So, I, guys, please play Prodigy a lot over the summer because... It's, it's a very, 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 like, like, it gives you very, very good items. Like, pro probably you've been hoping for this buddy called the Sparkle Snap. So perhaps we could get it from the loot drop. I'm so excited. So this, so I've been answering extra questions lately. Oh, the person who asked me to make this video, I'm going to give a shout out to her or him. Drum roll, please. So my yeah, Pradeep. I don't know if I'm pronouncing this wrong. But the person who commented to for me to make this video, that's I think what her name is. So my yeah, Pradeep. Alright, so here is the next update. So, um, actually, this the the person who I just gave the shout out to asked me to make this update. Coming August 2020. Your sneak peek into Prodigy's next chapter. Coming August 2020. Changes in the air. We've got some excited things planned for the next school year. And we can't wait to share them with you. Here at Prodigy, we're taking the summer to make what's bright brighter. To give ourselves a bit of a refresh if you will, and show up to the next school year with our best foot forward and maybe a fresh new haircut. Wink. Aw, I love haircuts. This summer, we're ready to shake things up. So, there's this video about something in summer. Let's make what's bright brighter. And stand out. So the next year can pop. So, I actually, I want to pause this because next year is not only what you say, it's how you say it. Such a good phrase. Learning is a lifelong adventure. And we are excited to reveal our next chapter. Coming August 2020. I'm so excited. Okay, so I just went down inside this Prodigy blog. And so Prodigy is actually changing its logo. So it's changing. Um, and it's also changing its like um, title. Like Before it's like Play Prodigy Game. Like Prodigy Game. And now it's cha changing it to Prodigy Education. So I have a feeling this might be good. Because people like. Parents probably think, like, game is not really educational and they probably won't let kids play it. But education sounds much more uh, parent-worthy saying, if you get what I mean. So at, at least that's a way more better than Prodigy Hall of Heroes. Some people actually think that Prodigy was actually going to change Hall of Heroes. But Survey, this guy who actually brought this rumor up that Prodigy's going to change it to Hall of Heroes, it's called Survey. He asked many questions like that before. Like, we are going to change, um, well, let's, let's give it, let me, let me give you an example, like, we're going to change Benny's name in Skywatch. What, what would you like it to be? And he was going to say something like that. So this is just like one of those silly rumors because Benny is still in Belly and <laughs> Benny and Broccolina are still in Skywatch alone. So they, so so the so the new logo is going to be really good too. So we can't share it with you yet, but our logo is changing too. So like there was this small cute monster. Like um, if you can see over here, let me go ahead and bring the monster up. If you like, go over here and and oops, you can't see that up there. So um, there should be a prodigy logo up here. So as you see, there is this small monster over here. 
and it's gonna change to this big bear thingy and um you know you know the guy who like celebrates with you when you're done answering a question that guy will change and the logo that you see outside it will change too so that's gonna be pretty cool too Oh, and also, there's gonna, there, there was like, in, like, um, like, there was like a rumor going around that, like, Prodigy was gonna make it, everything 3D. I actually believe that, too. Because it says it up here, so. Our new illustrations. Our world is in a constant state of change, with or without us. That, that meant our illustration style needs to adapt, with a pop of color and an extra dimension. And we think we found it with our fun 3D style. But, a, but, but in Prodigy's, like, website or something like that, a person asked about 3D thing and Prodigy said, no, they're not going to change it. They're not going to make it 3D. And I was like, what? That's not possible. And I like, and I like was like, um, and I looked over here one more time and said, oh, okay. So they must have not changed it in here yet. Perhaps they were thinking about it, but they probably thought it was way too, uh, I don't know, complicated or it, it would make the, or they probably did something wrong and, and one of the characters might have looked different or they completely changed their mind and thought the game looked exactly like it. Like if you look so like if you look it says it says like let's stand out. This is a this is a boring rocket now, but now it's three D, it's completely flying. See this is boring. And this is completely three D, it's like rotating, it looks so three D. It would have looked awesome, but I wish Prodigy had actually changed it to 3D. But it might, but then the names and the fair face might have looked different, and I would have been like, eek! So that was the new logo, and and the, the 3D update is not coming. So then that's and that's confirmed. Okay, so back to this blog, Prodigy is actually making some new fonts. You know, like when you answer a question correctly, it says correct, and this small monster guy celebrates with you. And so our new fonts. This in this in this article says our new fonts. Prodigy celebrates the inner tension of learning. What may be diff difficult can also be fun and positive. So we paired two fonts to represent both elements that make them such that make learning such a journey. <laughs> Prodigy Sans. Okay, so so the name of the font is Prodigy Sans. Is a simple yet elegant sans serif commissioned by us and is and made available for free to anyone use. It's the Prodigy way. Quick is a hand script font that represents the imaginative and optimistic energy that we, including people like you, bring to learning day in <laughs> day in and day out. So if we go to Prodigy, we actually might change the um these the, the font for like the names like like over here I'm in Bonfire Spire, the Royal Kitchen. And it says that this is Queen Gulia. It might change change it to like kind of like a weird bold kind of product prodigy sans sans serif hybrid type font. And the guard slime might be kind of like cursive or something. I'm not really sure because I, I'm so excited because prodigy fonts are so cool. And they're probably gonna also change the sounds too. All right, guys. So that was the new update that's gonna come in August 2020. And I'm also really excited about Prodigy's Summer Question Quest. This, again, the special loot drop is really, really, really special. There's like a bunch of cool things in there that you could get. Last time, I, last time, like a long, long time ago, when Prodigy did a loot drop, I'm not sure when, I was hoping for this item. I'm not sure. I think it was a sparkle item, like a sparkle kitty or a sparkle dog or something. So, so like, I, I actually got that from the loot drop. My special dream, I had got that. So right now, we're all wondering for the sparkle snub. So if we answer 500 million questions, we all might get a sparkle snub. Cheers for the sparkle snub. And shine bright like a snub is its description. So I like to shine bright. Like, the prodigy is going to make everyone shine bright, just like a snub. That will be a good example. Alright guys, so that was the new Prodigy Summer Quest coming up. Enjoy the world of Prodigy while I'm gone, especially the Summer Question Quest once more. The, the loot drops are so cool. I think they're going to be, be like member checks, except they're going to go to people who aren't members. And now I'll see you in the next Prodigy video. I can't wait to see you next time. In the meantime, I'm going to answer a bunch of questions so we can all, together as teamwork, accomplish the 500 billion goal of the Prodigy people.